devastating news because Vicky was quite a, an unusual person because the vast majority of people in those circumstances would simply uh, concentrate on their declining years or months of their lives. Vicky took, up, took it upon herself to campaign for women's health and uh, you know that, that was an enormous burden obviously for, especially for somebody who was ill and who was suffering and uh, she did tremendous work. I mean, there's no doubt about that. She did tremendous work and, 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 and won the admiration of people, not just in Ireland, but indeed all over the world. And she'll be a tremendous loss as a campaigner. And of course, she is a devastating loss to her family, you know, to whom we send our sympathy. And uh, to, to, to Limerick generally, because Limerick became, uh, you know, very much associated with Vicky Phelan. And... Um, you know, it's 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 something that'll be that'll be regretted, I'm sure, on all sides of the political divide. And uh, you know, I, I hope she's at peace now, but she suffered greatly and as I said, through her suffering, uh, she devoted the remaining part of her life, which was cut very short obviously, to fighting and campaigning for women's health and took on that enormous burden, which, you know, would have would have exhausted somebody, you know, who was in the full of their health. So, you know, it's a tribute to her indomitable courage. And her commitment and uh, her, her 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 sense of, of of you know obligation to fight for women, women's health as a result of this particular scandal and just you know no words of mine could express the admiration that we all feel for her and uh, there's great tribute due to her and she will her contribution will never be forgotten i mean the freedom of the city is something that's given very very sparingly i mean you could literally count on the fingers of one hand the people have been honored by getting the freedom of the city and uh, certainly, you know, if you look at the list of people who've got the freedom of the city, I've no doubt they all deserve it, and they've all have considerable achievements in their name. But I mean, if anybody deserved the freedom of the city, it certainly was Vicky Phelan, and I was delighted the council took that initiative.